I am making another video. So yesterday I did the review on Pepsi Wild Cherry made with real sugar. And today I'm doing, actually, um, it's the return of a series that I originally had called Soda Talk. And I believe I did a, I believe I did episode one with Oliver, like, um, five, like, it's been four or five months, I think. Yeah, four or five months since I made that video. So today I'm doing Soda Talk episode two. And today I have three sodas to talk about. Um, the first one is Mountain Dew Baja Blast, which is a limited edition can for 2015. And it has a nice, it has a nice design on it, like kind of like a nice greenish, bluish design. And um. And it's due with the blast of natural and artificial tropical lime flavor. And this is 170 calories and 44 grams of sugar. And um, 58 grams of caffeine per 12, ounce, per 12 ounces. So, it's pretty cool. And also, it tastes a lot better in a can, in this can, in a can, than... It does have Taco Bell. So, yeah. Baja Blast. Really, really neat can. If you haven't already, go out and get yourself some Baja Blast. And the neck. So, it's really good. This gets a 5 out of 5. Um, and the next soda is going to be Pepsi Cola made with real sugar. And it's the wild cherry flavor. And I got this at my at my um, grocery store, my local grocery store. And now this is 20 calories less than the Baja Blast. This is 150 calories and 40 grams of sugar and um, 38 grams of caffeine. So that's that's about see here about 20 20 less grams of, of caffeine than um than the Baja Blast did and it also has a neat design with the old Pepsi logo from the 50s I believe yeah 50s so it has a nice logo the original Pepsi logo and it's sort of it's sort of reddish pinkish the can is and yeah this is really good my opinion this stuff is better than the regular pepsi wild cherry in my opinion because it just tastes like more sweeter and um it, ta it just tastes more sweeter and um so, yeah, I definitely recommend the Pepsi Wild Cherry Real Sugar over the original um, Pepsi Wild Cherry. It's so good. So, this gets a 5 out of 5 also. Definitely really good Pepsi. And it's only out for a limited time, guys. So, if you haven't already, um, go on and get go on and get a 12-pack. I believe it's available in bottles, too, but... Where I live, I can only find it in 12 packs, so. And now, the final soda, I would like to, and now the final soda is Dr. Pepper, which this is kind of a cool can of Dr. Pepper, because it has the Avengers on it, and it's a limited edition can, which I might put, which I will put in my collection. It seems pretty cool. And, um, yeah, and Dr. Pepper's also 150 calories and 40 grams of sugar and this. And this has 41 grams of caffeine. So, yeah, this is also a good soda. It's... Um, a lot of people 
say it's cherry cola, but, um, I don't think it tastes like cola, like cherry cola. I think it just tastes like normal cola. And, yeah, it's really good. And, um, in some areas, it's also, some areas it's made by Coke. Some areas it's, some areas it's, it's made by Coke. Some areas it's made by Pepsi. So, but apparently in our, in my area, it's made by Pep, made by, um, Pepsi, so, yeah. Are you listening to me? Yeah, it has, and on the back, it also has Iron Man on it, so, Are that's, you listening to that's me? cool. So, um, this gets a, so Dr. Pepper gets a four out of five. Um, it's not the best, it's not the best cola. Well, it's really good, but it's not, but it's not, uh, very, but it's, it's pretty good, but it's not the best cola, because it doesn't have very much flavor, so, yeah, this gets a 4 out of 5, and that was pretty much wraps up Soda Talk, episode 2, all these sodas are really good, and you should definitely, um, you should definitely try them out if you haven't already. Um, especially the, especially the Pepsi Cola with Pepsi Cola, the wild cherry with real sugar. So, cause that is excellent, guys. So, um, so this was Soda Mix, ep- so not Soda Mix, Soda Talk episode two, and see you guys in the next um video. So, see you guys.